What's going on guys, Rob A here, and today we're going to be taking a look at Megablocks Call of Duty Zombies Outbreak. Uh, this is the sister set to the Zombies Horde um, set that came out last year. Uh, it has 75 pieces and features six shambling zombies and, uh, and a little bit of a uh, chain link fence here in the back, which looks pretty cool, I have to say. I don't... I'm not sure how it's made. I think it's just a uh, net that's kind of on a little bar. We'll see. Hopefully it's more involved than that. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully. Uh, but anyway, you can see on the back here, there's a little... Yeah, I mean, it's, you know, it's it's zombies. You get zombies in here. So I'm just going to open this up, and we will check it out uh, right now. All right, guys, zombie outbreak. Here we go. And... Um, like we always go do, we're gonna check out the micro action figures first, and it's a good thing because that's really all there is to this set. But uh, so we're gonna start out here, because because he's closest. And here's your first zombie, Mr. Green, covered in dried blood. Uh, now, for those of you unaware that do not maybe have any of these zombie sets yet, um, the articulation is not the same as in your standard. Uh, Mega Bloks Call of Duty figure. Uh, all you've got here, the, the legs are in a stuck position. You've just got a torso swivel, minor torso swivel at that. Um, arms can go up and down and around, and the head is on a ball joint. And that's really all there is. Ooh, but you reveal cool stuff like his his gutted out throat. Um, but yeah. That's all there really is to it, but you get uh, you, you tend to get more, uh, whereas you know no, you normally get four to five guys in your uh, in your regular uh, troop pack, uh, and the zombie ones you get six. Uh, so here we have your first zombie, looking like so. There he is, and the back. Put him off. <clears throat> and zombie number two. And the back. And there you go. What? Uh, zombie number three. Couldn't even be bothered to put on a shirt. That's okay. We still love you, guy. Just because of your smile. Uh. There you go. Looks like he's wearing pajama pants. So he's he's off to Walmart. All right, <clears throat> next up, this guy also not wearing a shirt, uh, but with a different head. Kind of switch things up, and then different colored pants, of course, and the back. This guy who's got the uh, I guess there are two. Well, yeah, there's there's a couple of unique guys in here. This guy's got kind of the the straight jacket look, which. Um, was much more prominent in the first wave of these zombie sets. But he's looking very, very uh, Crypt Keeper-esque. And the back. And of course, last but not least, our, uh, our tank top wearing zombie. Come on, buddy. With his crazy amounts of blood drooling out of his face and onto his shirt. And, uh, yeah. And on the back. This guy's just, just coated. And you can even see, like, all the bubbles where the, the paint was just really, really watery. And they just kind of went down. And yeah, so, very cool. Um, you do get a little, little chunk of scenery with this. And, and they do a really nice job. They use this kind of net, uh, bit to kind of simulate a chain link fence and it, it works uh, pretty nicely and the cool thing is you know you know you got your zombie here and you can kind of have him crawling underneath the the fencing as well you know and you can have it like tear tear the fence down or whatever so you can get a lot of cool stuff going on here you got the barbed wire which is always a really nice addition to have some little planks going on here and uh, there really isn't too much to this at all uh, as you can see but you know it's if you get if you get a bunch of these guys, you can make a nice little fence set up and kind of have your horde coming along. But, uh, yeah, I mean, as far as uh, value is concerned, these guys, it's a, it's a way better deal, in my opinion, than the, uh, the Alcatraz set. If you're looking for zombies, 
You get six in this set. You only get, I think, three in that. And, uh, you know, this is half the price. Um, and, you know, the, the Alcatraz set, in my opinion, was kind of a kind of a letdown as far as builds go. But uh, so if you've collected a couple of these uh, through, you know, through the various waves, you get, uh, you know, you can start to build up quite a quite a little hoard here. And uh, I look forward <laughs> to the next Mega Block sale uh, because I will probably pick up some more of these guys and uh, have a nice, nice, real old fashioned outbreak on my hands. So that is going to do it for this review, guys. Uh, I want to thank you so very much for watching, as always. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help me out. And, uh, got more mega blocks coming real soon so stay tuned for that in the meantime thank you guys so much again for watching i'll see you in the next one bye for now